What's up, guys? It's your boy Swan Sweet Taco here. Yeah, I'm back. It's been like 10 or 11 months. Um, story time. Uh, I had school. I got busy. Uh, I worked over my winter break. And then I ended school in May and I got a job on a fishing boat until like last week. And now I'm free. But this time I am back in school doing like one online class. Still gonna maybe be working on boats, don't know yet. So I should have time, uh, like one week working, one week not, to, to play games and uh, make some videos again. So this is mostly gonna serve as like a little channel update or whatever, and I'm just gonna be talking through some background gameplay. But one of the things I'm really looking forward to, uh, me and my friend Capitan Tromba, we have this great idea that the Russian 8.7 lineup is pretty goated. Uh, and so the lineup we have planned is the T55 AMD at 8.7, the Object 435 at 8.7, the BMP2 at 8.7. Me personally, I want to add the IT1 because that tank is absolutely broken at 8.7. And then I have the Object 279 at 87, and also the IS-7, which is uh, the same Canon, I believe, right? 130S70. Yeah, well, close enough. The 130 millimeter. this one has an autoloader, this one does not, but they're both 10-second reloads. Very tough tanks to kill. Um, so it is going to be very fun to do. At least I think it's going to be very fun to do. And I'm looking forward to to grind without a without a premium account which is going to be a a whole fun ordeal in my opinion um, i do have the t10a at 77 with the is4 and the t54 if i want to go and like kind of grind faster and i do have the the terms t if i want to um but i'm probably mostly going to be playing the 279 and the is7 and slowly adding in uh the different vehicles to it so yeah uh, on to the gameplay. Alright guys, so here we are. Me and my Object 279 and my IS-7. Uh, just some background gameplay while I just do a general commentary over it. Um, both of these tanks, if, I mean, I don't think you guys really have them realistically speaking. Like they sell on the gadgets sort of like $2,000 combined. But I have been playing this game for almost a decade. So I have them, and I will be using them to make my 8.7 dream lineup. Anyways, uh, yeah, it's kind of wild playing these tanks. Like, if you get a good BR rating, you just slap people silly. Uh, surprisingly fast, both of them. Good forward, good reverse. Insane guns. Machine guns are wild, too. On the 279, the machine gun has the same muzzle velocity as the cannon. So if you hit him with the machine guns, you'll hit him right there with the cannon. Which is kind of cool. Nice little like inbuilt rangefinder. IS-7 kind of same thing. 900 mils, 900 mils, 900 meters per second on the machine guns versus a thousand on the MG. Or I might have that backwards. Don't know. Don't care. Whatever. Uh, back to the channel update type of thing. So I get it. It's been about mm, ten months, almost a year. We're just gonna say a year. It's been a year since I last uploaded. Um, went to school. And then over the winter, I had a job offshore for like five weeks, and then I went back to school, and then school ended, and then I, I've been offshore dead ass since May 22 till recently. But now I'm done with that, and I'm taking like one online class. It's not going to be a big deal. Yes, I did see that tank before anyone says anything. But I'm about to commit a war crime by accidentally killing a child. Anyways. And so I will be in school doing an online class, just one, it seems, because my other one's about to get canceled. This is a child. I'm sorry. Rest in peace, my sweet little angel. Uh, 279 just eats bullets for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. I don't even know where I got shot from, but it doesn't matter. Uh, anyways, um, one class, and then I might have a job where I work offshore, like, one to two weeks at a time, and I'm home one to two weeks at a time. I don't know yet. I'm still trying to get the job, because, you know, stuff costs money. And so, with that, I, uh, I plan to, in my free time, because uh, the class is fairly easy, to start uploading YouTube videos again. 
Uh, I'm gonna be doing my just general War Thunder gameplay. Uh, me and my buddy, uh, Captain Tromba. Uh, he's, we're both grinding out the Russian 8.7 tech tree. I, I don't know if he has premium, but I sure as hell don't. So I will be free to play in it. I do have the T10A premium and the T Terms T premium. So if I ever want to just try grinding it a bit faster, I can always use those. Gets me, I know the T10 I can get about three to 4,000 RP per game, which is about one and a half to two times what I get in the 279, but the 279 is a lot more fun to use. Um, yeah. So I have that in plan. Uh, I have Horizon Zero Dawn. I played it. I'm gonna do a new game plus play tr playthrough. I'm thinking on Ultra Hard. Uh, that'll be fun to to show on stream. Um, I also, you know, have like the Borderlands series, Borderlands, Borderlands 2, pre sequel 3. <clears throat> Games like Neon Abyss and Binding of Isaac. I have Core Keeper, uh, which is a game I've played once, stopped playing it, and I'm going to replay it again. Uh, Terraria, sadly, that save file, like, kind of corrupted on my desktop. Uh, my hard drive, I think, is failing. I need to get another one one of these days. So that part kind of sucks. Um, but yeah, I have that. I think I might do some Tainted Grail, The Fall of Avalon. It looks like a fun game. Uh, it's hopefully been patched out, all the bugs. Uh, I've got Plague Tale Requiem. I've got Fallout 3, New Vegas, and 4, if y'all want to see me play through those. I've got Sniper Elite 2, 3, and 4, if y'all want to see me play through those. Lego Star Wars, Skywalker, Force Awakens, Clone Wars, Complete Saga. I actually already beat Complete Saga while I was off short. But if any of y'all want to see me play through those, um, South Park, The Fractured But Whole. I started it. Uh, it's kind of tough to play on the Steam Deck, so I never really played it. Uh, this leopard's about to absolutely get shat on. Anyways, um, that's it, really, for the most part, for the games. Oh, also Warframe. I stopped playing Warframe after, like, Tenocon, like, when Nidus Prime released, I think, if I remember correctly, like, before Dubari Paradox. So there's a lot of stuff, a lot of new stuff for me to do if I want to go down that path again. But realistically, uh, if any of what I've said so far piques your interest, just like leave a comment down below, let me know, and I can make an adjustment to my plans if that makes sense, and like do whatever. Um, I have some friends I told that I'm gonna be having a lot of free time, and if they would love to join me in making some YouTube videos, like I could do a Minecraft hardcore world, I could do it with my brother, I could do it with some friends, I could do Terraria. Uh, master mode where we're all only archers or something like that um, r Really like any of that is is fair game Or I could just do what I've been doing and just play the games I play and upload them like Like I said like tainted grail fall of Avalon or even tainted grail itself Which is like a card based game just do like you know pretty long videos nothing crazy uh, Just for the fun of it. I do also have like spirit fairer um, farewell edition so if y'all want to see me play through that game um, it's not the most exciting game per se but it is what it is if that's what you guys want uh, it's what I can do and then of course you know just War Thunder clips that I play um, that that's what I'm planning on doing at least it will be a bit uh, difficult I need to relearn how to edit videos and relearn like what settings on my mic work this is actually believe it or not my second uh, voiceover first one I did, I didn't have the proper mic settings, so you kept hearing a background buzz. Really annoying. Um, but it is, I mean, I'm, I'm learning. I'm learning again, so bear with me. And then, that's, uh, that's pretty much it in regards to that. Uh, I don't have anything crazy. I'm just really unlucky when it comes to shooting tanks. I get barreled. But I see this rocket tank, and thankfully, you know, a 14 mil machine guns can actually pen it. Only get an assist, sadly. And finish off this guy, which is nice. So, yeah. I mean, if there's anything you guys want to see from me in particular, let me know. If not, um, start expecting some regularly uploaded War Thunder videos, Horizon Zero Dawn videos on Ultra Hard. Um, I, I might, if I can convince a friend or two to join me in Borderlands, we might do a Borderlands like playthrough, all of us, like once a week. Just crank through it, crank through a couple hours of gameplay. And then also, uh, what was the other game I said? 
Oh yeah, Plague Tale. Plague Tale, that's something I'll be definitely playing through now that I'm home. But I will say this, I am actually going to leave my home for a couple of weeks, like next week. Uh, so I am uploading, I'm hoping to get like at least a Horizon episode out and a proper War Thunder episode with my buddy out. I don't think I'll be doing Plague or any of that, but just those two videos. Just to just to remember how to get into it. Also, the cheese, the cheese wedge tank absolutely sucks, right? I was greedy and I didn't scope in thinking I could kill it and I freaking hit its track. And it's good enough to where I can actually just go straight through a 279 like I am the one made of cheese. Kind of annoying if you ask me. But you know, we pull out the IS-7, the solid $1,500 tank. Um, I grinded it, believe it or not. But yeah, uh, that should be it for the most part. I'm just gonna let this match play out. I'm gonna skip through uh, this first intro part and then go to where I'm helping my buddy in the, I think it was, he was in the Object 935. We'll see him over here, the 936, I think. 906, I'm close, close enough. But yeah. Uh, we're both pushing up and I believe it was a Tiger 2P up here very weird angle can't really see it And I see his tracks are angled and I actually somehow penned him Very weird angle very weird shot. I'm not complaining though. I'll take Russian bias whenever I can get it at this point point. And then funny enough this next clip here for those of you that have windows Which is like 99% of us you got to love it when you get a windows update am I right or am I right? So buddy's pushing up, I see him, let me go support him. I don't know why the light tank is pushing up in front of the heavy tank. Uh, you know, don't ask me, because I clearly don't know. Right about now, audio cuts, Windows update. I reschedule it, but guess what? When I clicked rescheduled, the click went back in game, so I fired my shot, and then because I was driving before the update, it kept driving, so I just drove into my death no bullet no nothing it still took him a while to kill me which is why i love these tanks but i mean it is it, it's bothersome but that's my luck in this game but, yeah i uh, hope you guys enjoyed uh we're gonna send this off with i want to say a bang but i know what's about to happen it's not a bang because i'm bad at the game but yeah i mean hope you guys enjoy uh i'm looking forward to restarting uh recording editing uploading my videos uh replying to your comments and things like that and just generally having a fun little time but the machine gun's pretty op if you ask me anyways hope y'all enjoyed and i will see you guys in my next episode peace out